things aren't sized, so they're put in a stockpile and uh, consolidated. Out of the stockpile, they go into a closed circuit impactor. The impactor has a one inch screen on it, so all the material gets crushed, and sized, and screened to a one inch minus. The one inch minus is the gradation specification for this project. That material goes into another stockpile, which is ready to be loaded into the uh, self contained portable recycling unit. Another wheel loader will pick up those the stockpile sized millings, dump it into the hopper of the recycling plant. At that point, it gets weighed via a conveyor weigh bridge. The material goes into a dual shaft pug mill, and at that point, the uh, engineered emulsion is added at the prescribed mixed design rate. The material then comes out of the uh, stockpile or the stacker belt and then another loads it another loader is there to load it into the trucks so we're running five trucks for the paving operation and we're running five trucks for the milling operation and then where does the uh, where does the material go back after that after the trucks get loaded with the uh, the recycled asphalt those trucks go directly out to the paving operation they back up they dump directly into the hopper of the paving machine that's being spread at a, a, at a rate of four inches loose to get them a compacted depth of three inches. They're using a double steel drum uh, vibratory roller and a 25 ton minimum pneumatic roller to get compaction. Out on the, out on the mat, there's a uh, quality control testing being conducted to make sure they're getting maximum density and maximum compaction utilizing the equipment on site.